Hi Gemini, this is Marishi on my channel Kaloka. I'm using my slow tarot deck to see what messages or what guidance is coming through for the first half of September 2019. I've already pulled out three sets of cards. Uh, you've got the Seven of Swords as your first card. Okay, in reverse. You've got the Nine of Wands, a Knight of Wands in reverse. And the last card is an Ace of Coins. For some of you Geminis out there, it feels like um, everything is out of balance. Okay. Behind the deck is the Ten of Swords. How depressing is this card? Okay, Ten of Swords. Literally, people might have betrayed you. Okay, when I broke the deck, I saw this Five of Swords. Okay, which confused me. So I broke the deck again, and I saw the Emperor card in reverse. Okay, so uh, just taking into consideration all these three cards together, I would say, for some of you people out there, it might feel like your situation is going out of your hand, okay? Nothing is working according to the plan, even fate is against you, okay? Whatever you, uh, you do, it messes up, okay? Nothing, everything is beyond your power, okay? Emperor in reverse is somebody who, who is like lost, okay? It's like his throne. His power is, is going out of his hand, okay? He's literally questioning whether, you know, uh, he's worth the throne or not. He's worth this position or not, okay? Questioning yourself, questioning yourself. Why is everything going against you, okay? With this fire swords, it's like literally, you're like, why God, why, why? Can't you help me out? Can't you help me out? Because you're so depressed, okay? With failures and betrayals from other people that you're tired. Okay, in both the cards, the person is lying down. Okay, one is like one is like people betraying you. You're tired. You're exhausted. You're dead. Okay, it's ten swords on your back, man. How are you going to even survive this? Although this person's eyes is open, I don't think that they're going to survive it, okay? It's a messed up. It's a messed up card, okay? Very depressing card. But then, it, it's not about just the surrounding. It's, it's even you questioning the person up there. Why are you doing this to me? Can't you just help me out from this? That kind of an energy, okay? Because you're losing everything around you. You're losing your power within every situation which you put your hands into. Like going uh, to the Queen of Wands reverse as well, you might have tried everything possible to get back on your throne. But yet, it seems like everything is slipping out of your hands. Okay? Everything around you is shaky. You can't put it back together again. You were imbalanced in the headspace because you're losing you grasp over the situation, okay? Coming back to the sets, um, first card is the Seven of Swords. So it's like literally you might have done something behind somebody's back, okay? You might have sneaked away. So it shows me with the first card, it's like, you know, a past energy. Now it is out in the open, okay? People might have found out about something. Hmm? And it, this is like, um, Knight of Wands um, in reverse is like a situation where you don't have the potential to get out of it. Even with the Emperor's, uh, Emperor in reverse, it's like you don't know how to get out of it. It's like a fucked up situation. You know, this, this in upright, I would have said, you know, you will think out of the box to get out of it. You know, you will do anything, okay, anything which is adventurous. To get out of it but here it's like in reverse it's like there is not much more uh, much potential okay within the situation because of something which has come to light okay because of something which has come to light something like uh, which is which got noticed okay if you look at this card it's like uh, the person is looking back okay he's stealing and you know uh, sneaking away into the night through the window and he is watching his back he thinks nobody is watching, but then if you look at this little cat down there, this cat is watching and he's unaware about this situation. In reverse, I would say it is already out in the open what was being done 
behind the back. Okay? Whatever you're sneaking away with, it has come out in the light. Okay? And that has screwed up. Okay? That has screwed up to such an extent, everything is going against you. Okay? Ace of Pentacles. Whatever you had in hand, okay, you don't have the opportunity anymore. You, like I, I told you in the beginning, it is not in your grasp anymore. This Ace, again, there is an, a picture of this Emperor. I think it's a Caesar or someone. Anyways, it's like the Emperor on the coin. Now your value has depreciated for some reason. Okay, you had something, a high status before, now it's like crumbling down. Now you, you don't have that, uh, you know, it's like people frame somebody like, you know, uh, to respect them. Now you're not in that picture. Hmm? That's what I see in this, uh, in this three cards. Just give me a second. I'll grab some water. This is the last reading. Uh, so, it's Thursday. Anyways, um, with the star card in reverse as your first card and the second set, it's like you, you don't know how to move forward. This is like, you know, a guided situation. You're looking out into the sky to guide you out of the situation. Okay, you're looking up there. You know, in, in the olden days, people used to look into the sky and the stars will guide them. Hmm? That's how I see this card, okay? Uh, you follow the North Star or something to guide you into the right direction, okay? It's also like you are depending on fate to guide you, like the gods to guide you out of the situation. But here, it feels a little hopeless, okay? It's in reverse. It's in reverse because you don't know where you will go henceforth. Okay, that's what I see from this card. Regards to your balance. Okay, the second card is a balance. So you're a little out of balance in the mind space, not knowing what to do. Okay, you don't know how to bring things back together, back to how it was before this was found out. Okay getting things back into grasp you're clueless okay how to make things work as it was before because as i said things are slipping out of your grasp okay and it is very difficult this is the third card it is very difficult you're struggling that's why i see it's it's weighing you down not knowing what to do how to move forward is weighing you down completely you're exhausted you're exhausted Nobody is supporting you as well. Okay? You are getting no support from others. I will say you might have hurt people with these three, uh, two cards, the seven of swords. Whatever they found out about you has hurt them so bad that they left you. You know? They left you out in the cold like you know they have nothing to do with you and you feel you know it isn't even fair everything is going against you and it's getting difficult it's getting difficult to balance the situation not knowing where it's going to go from here losing your power within the situation okay charity in reverse Okay, like I said, with the star card, you have no idea how to move on. You, you don't even get the um, ideas, not ideas, guidance. Even maybe from my reading, you won't get the guidance. <laughs> it seems like that. Okay, this reading is mostly done to give you guidance. How to move forward in the first, first half of the month. But here it's like... You literally have no guidance how to move forward. The chariot card. Okay, how much ever you're prepared, it is not even enough. Okay, to fix the situation with this balance card, to bring balance in your situation, you have no idea, and it is it is it is a struggle, it is a burden to even get through. You're so stressed out. 
okay? With the Four of Cups and the world, you want things back together, okay? Back to where it was. You want the world to fix, to get fixed, okay? You want things to get back into, you know, the orbit. Like, you know, you have so much, uh, there is so much, um, what is it? Planets revolving, okay? Around the orbit, okay? So you want some kind of enlightenment where you know things are going to go in the orbit as it should be, how it was before it messed up. You want things back, okay? Because that is what you are expecting with this Four of Cups in reverse. You know what exactly you want. Although it seems like, you know, things are stuck right now. Things are not moving according to the plan. You have no support from anybody. Even the gods out there is not supporting you. You feel like that. Okay. But what you want is, you know, you're wishing and you know exactly what you want is to fix things up. What I'll do for you guys is since it's a very, very, very depressing reading, I don't want you to do start badgering me in the comments so just give me a second since it's the last reading and it's only 11 minutes it's a short and simple reading i didn't want to say anything much other than how fucked up it was okay what guidance do we have for the gemini people out there what guidance do we have for the gemini people Page of Cups, Reverse, and I'm giving you one more. So, Chariot, okay, just give me a second. Give me one more card, please. Okay, so that's your guidance, okay? You can fix things, okay? Page of Cups, Reverse, although it seems like it is a hopeless, that's what the whole storyline wanted to say. I think even the guides are playing with you, showing you, you deserve it. <laughs> yeah. But, I'm giving you guidance okay with this reading i don't do it for uh for anybody else but here page of cups in reverse you feel like there is no hope within the situation but chariot is upright okay here in the reading chariot is um in reverse throughout the situation what i was trying to say you think within yourself there is no way there um it is going to move on from the situation but yet you want the world okay you want things to go how it is supposed to go okay get back to where it should be which is what literally what you want okay what you want to be served what you you know exactly wish for okay so the chariot is going to happen whatsoever okay things are going to move ahead okay you need to stop sulking okay this is a five of cups you need to stop sulking over what has been lost okay um Look at the two cups which is standing upright, which is behind you, okay? You might have been ignoring it, but that is your guidance, okay? You can fix things which can be fixed. What is lost, it is lost, okay? Um, you need to move forward. Take the reins of your um, life back. Instead of sitting and sulking and blaming everybody around you, you need to take, this, uh, uh, take the reins yourself. And move on with logic being practical you need to know what is lost and what can be saved okay uh, it is showing me this four of cups you will get um, you will get what you want these two cards tell me you will get what you want, okay? Once you start moving forward, taking charge of the situation. Four of Wands is your card behind the deck and it is like bringing back everything, okay? If you try, you will get back everything what you want. You will heal the situation. Three of Swords in reverse, you will heal the situation. So I think you should be happy about that. Okay, just let this, um, you know, take it slow. Slowly move forward. Okay, be focused. Okay, because it's a shitty situation. 
it seems like you have nobody support okay it feels so much out of your hand but yet you need to keep trying okay or trying to fix what can be fixed if that makes sense and you will get at least something positive out of it you will heal the situation okay i think i'll stop here this is marish in my channel to look at until next week bye